my name is Effect and today I'll be doing another video and today I'll be teaching you how to change your Steam layout skin and at the moment we got this very broad layout skin this is the default one which comes with Steam and I know loads of people really want to change this want to make it a bit more funky or blah 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 but today I'm going to be teaching you how you can do this and one of the first things you need to do is go to the link in the description below and this is Steam Skins 2010 UI this is updated was was quite updated quite recently and it should be you know updated a couple every a couple of weeks and it's got all these different steam layouts by all these different amazing people so we can preview this and we can see we've got you know all these different and cool new UIs um, for today's purpose I'm going to be using this Metro for Steam and if we go to preview it goes into DeviantArt and you see it's sort of like a Windows 8 styled um, layout and that's what we're going to be downloaded today so first of all you want to go to one of these one of these layouts whatever you could have chosen and you've got to go to download and um, well, so we just download the file and it should be in a zip now you want to drag this into your desktop and then you want to open it and I'm using WinRAR for this purpose, so I'm not sure about any of you others. And then there will be two folders. Now it will say install this font. Now you need to install this. Now if you don't know how to install the font, I'm just going to do it right now. So you go into computer, go to your drive where Windows is stored, go to Windows, fonts, and then you want to drag this into it and it should start installing. Now I don't want to because I've already got this installed. Next you want to go here and you want to drag this out and put this onto your desktop. Next you want to go to Program Files 8x86 although if you have a 32-bit operator, operator so just go to Program Files and then Steam Skins and it should be all these different um, all your skins will be stored here. Now I've already got the Metro for Steam already installed so I'm just going to delete it and I'm just going to reinstall it again just put it back in and now we're done. Now the way you got to change this just go under Steam settings and interface and it will say you know favorite store so for example I can actually just it's loads of stuff here and we can choose the du default skin which we've got right now or we can use the one that we've just installed. So all I need to do is go Metro for Steam, OK, restart Steam, and it should restart Steam in this new Windows 8 fashion. It looks really cool. So if we just load it up, yeah. So now everything looks very, very different. And hopefully you've enjoyed this, the following videos. So hopefully I will see you in the next video.